Welcome to Harper Valley Farm, where we started with a one acre property with just a couple of goats and learning to be self-sufficient. But with all our ups and downs, we are now back at our family farm, or shall I say, my parents' property, where we have doubled in size with our sheep and goats and everything else, where we are learning to homestead and be more self-sufficient. Follow us as we document our real and raw homesteading journey. Well, hello everybody once again from Harper Valley Farm. It has been a while. Nothing much has been going on here. We hit about minus 40. We had to build a quick building in there. I'll show you in a minute. But we have a couple other things to do in our big tarp building today. So let's get to it. So we built that building when it was about minus 40-ish so that you can stay warm. It is a big mess in here. But today we are finally building my milking room in a kind of a warm room kind of thing. Thanks. Okay, after some nailing and some handy dandy cutting from this swell guy, we have the floor done. Now we just need to put some OSB on top. Yeah. So I am not that much help today. I feel miserable. I'm not feeling 100% today. So I haven't been doing much. This guy's been doing a heck of a lot. So we have got the floor on. We are starting on the studs and the walls. So for here, because this building is angled or uh, domed, whatever you call it, yeah. Andrew needs to figure out an angle for these studs because we have to bring it in this way. <sighs>
All right, so that wasn't fun, that was tiring. But we got it in. So we got this wall in, this in, and we got to start on that. But I'm not feeling well, so I'm gonna go relax. Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.